G'day viewers, this is Troy from the Troy's Digital Arts channel. I've been pondering on the idea of um, replacing the old blower fan motor from a Mark 80 Mark III power supply unit down there with a vacuum cleaner motor. This uh, vacuum cleaner motor has got a lot of um, power. I don't even have to take it up to 100 volts and it's like spinning like crazy. Anyhow, um, yeah. I've uh, fully disassembled the the fan blade system from the fan unit from the motor spindle that looks to be all worn out. The commutator middle pieces are like pretty well fused together so there'd be probably shorts and it would inhibit the performance of the motor I believe or make it not work at all. Anyhow I've removed the fan blade and I'm sort of looking for a good shaft system to stick it on and I need to somehow connect it to this motor and somehow fix that to the to the uh, fan blade hood system which of course will concentrate the cool air to to this um, exit area and blow it to the valves and also blow the air forward to the power transformer on the inside of that enclosure inside the power supply unit. Anyway, um, yeah, I found a rod that decently fits. This is um, fixed on with a little grub screw on the inside. So yeah, it connects quite well. And I reckon I'll probably saw a section of this um, spindle off and use it. This came from a laser print, I believe, this spindle. Or an old, I think the older dot matrix printer, one of the two. And now I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to rig up this motor, um, vacuum cleaner motor, to the Variac and power it up a bit to show you how much power it has obviously it has to have a lot of power so the vacuum cleaner can totally suck because <laughs> obviously you want a vacuum cleaner that really sucks <laughs> bit of a bad joke there anyway i'm just going to connect the mains leads i have to keep them apart so they don't short across otherwise they'll be bit of spark action happening gonna power it up a little bit I'm barely putting 10 volts in this thing and this thing is really flying 40 volts boy does it spin <laughs> uh, it's only like 40 volts AC this uh, motor is pretty well rated at 1200 watts and runs off standard mains 240 volts and yeah um, I'm not sure how many RPM it gives but I believe it would be a hell of a lot more than 2500 RPM that's specified on the old motor used for the Marconi Mark III power supply anyhow I, I think I'll probably have to put a lower a have to work out what the RPM speed of this motor is and work out how many um, volts I need to put in this to make it run at about 2500 well, I can make it probably run a bit more than that the the faster it blows the more cooler the electronics will be but yeah doesn't need a lot of volts to run at very um, high speed Anyhow, hopefully there'll be a way I can I can assemble this motor with the fan hood and the fan blade system and it be a good replacement for the old motor that's pretty well stuffed. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure if this motor is repairable or not. I don't know. If the fact that these metal pieces being fused together will totally inhibit its performance or will reduce its performance. But yeah, it's from like thousands of hours of 
rubbing against the metal brushes. Anyway, we'll keep you updated on how I gave this idea of using a vacuum cleaner motor as the new motor to drive the blower fan system. Stay tuned. This is Troy from Troy's Gelats Channel signing out.